You see, what is wonderful about the period we're living now is all these artificial borders between uh, visual arts, photography, design, uh, between fashion, between uh, architecture, all these artificial borders are completely disappearing. And for me, there's only one thing. Either somebody is a great artist or he's not. So you have some incredible artists who express themselves by creating furniture or objects that you can use in a, on a daily basis. And some artists like the Australian megastar of the design world, uh, uh, Mark Newson, or the equally great uh, megastar, uh, Ron Arad, are producing unbelievably beautiful objects that are stunning sculptures, stunning works of art. And on top of that, you can sit on them or you can live with them. And so it's, uh, and, and nowadays, somebody who collects great art doesn't want to have ugly furniture in his home or mediocre uh, daily objects. He wants to surround himself with the best. And it has to be challenging, stimulating and exciting, whatever it is that you surround yourself with. It becomes a work of art when it is aesthetically pleasing, when it uh, is so extraordinary that you look at it far beyond its function, that you no longer look at it just as a piece of furniture, but where you think that it's so stunning that it is a great work of art. Mm -hmm.